In a matchup of two 5-1 teams with the ECC medium division title on the line, Waterford struck first at Ledyard's Bill McNaught Field on Friday night, scoring with 3.42 remaining in the first quarter on a 31-yard pass from Brian Jancarelli to David Zaldemar. But it took Ledyard only three minutes to get even on a 39-yard touchdown run by Alex Manwaring. In the second quarter, with Waterford deep in its own territory, Ledyard's Dallas Smith comes off the end to catch Jancarelli in the backfield, hauling him down in the end zone for a safety to make the score 9-7. to Our coach does a great job at preparing us, and he was telling me that they do a little sprint out with the quarterback around the edge, and he told us as long as we blitz the way we were supposed to, we'd be right in his face. And sure enough, he did the sprint out. I was right there in his face, and I was able to get that sack for the safety. Dallas has just been steady for us all year. You know, he's been you know, playing outstanding football for us at outside linebacker. And seeing a young man like him succeed in his senior season uh, and be the leader of this football team uh, says a lot about his character and um, just real happy for him. Watford squandered its two best chances in the third quarter. Going for it on fourth and five, Jankarelli hit Zaldivar down the sideline, but Matt Daggett strips the ball away on the five. The Lancers defense held, and then appeared to have a safety when the fourth down snap went over punter Slade Baxley's head in the end zone. But the score was negated when Waterford was flagged for too many players on the field. We have the ball right down here on the five yard line going in. What do we do? We fumble it away. We have a safety to tie the game. What do we do? We have 12 men on the field. It's our fault. We're the only ones who, uh, we shoot ourselves in the foot, and the thing is, when you, when you put those together, maybe it's a different, different ball game. With 5.16 to go in the fourth, Manwaring would add another touchdown run of 11 yards to make it 15-7. With the win, Ledger clinches the ECC medium division title and stays in good shape in the Class M state playoff rankings. It feels great. Like, that's been our goal from day one. That's been our first long-term goal. Like, the short-term goals were conquer the day, do great in that practice, then do great in the next game. And our first long-term goal was to win the ECC medium division title. It feels great now that we have won it. And so we're gonna enjoy it. And then Sunday, it's back to the grind. We have East Lime next week. It's gonna be a great game. And we're looking forward to a challenge.